Hello and welcome back to the Crypto Yard, with a new video of Saitama Burn and Price Update. Let's start with checking how many new holders have joined the Saitama community. So, if we go to coinmarketcap.com, we will see that there are around 190,432 people who have Saitama on their watch list. Yesterday we had around 189,164 people who had Saitama on their watch lists, which means, around 1,268 people have added Saitama to their watch lists in 24 hours. Also if we go and check how many holders right now own Saitama, we will find that we have around 310,113 people who own Saitama. Yesterday we had the same 310,113, which means no new holders have bought Saitama and added it to their wallets. So, if we go here and check the burn rate, we will find that we have today around 43 quadrillions and 868 trillion in the circulating supply. And around the 56 quadrillions and 131 trillion tokens have been burned. Yesterday we had around 56 quadrillion and 125 trillion, which means, in one day only, we had burned 6 trillion. This means, if we continue to burn 6 trillion a day, at the end of the year we will burn 2 quadrillion tokens. If we take a look at the latest price move for Saitama. We are going to look at the chart for the daily price first. So, if we start with one day, we will find yellow line represents a downtrend, which means a decrease in price. We see here a supporter line at the 704, which will support the price to not go below the 704 price zone. Also, we see a resistance line at the 6 price mark, which used to be supported the days before. And now we see another supporter line at the 705 price zone, which used to be a resistance line for the price to pass the 706. Every time the price is trying to pass the 6 price mark, it is pushed back all way down to the 4 zone, which pushes up again to retrace at the 705 price zone. This could be repeated the whole day, the price between the 4 and 5 zones. If more buyers get in and buy Saitama, we expect the price will bounce back break through the 706 zones. And if there is more hype the price will break through the 706 resistance line and touch the 7 price zone. Otherwise, the price will stay between the 4 and 5 zones and touch the 6 price zone. If we take a deeper look at the 4 hours chart, we will see a downtrend still that is in blue. And our daily yellow resistance line and supporter are still with us in the 4 hours chart. The price is trying to pass the 706, but it retraced back. All the way to the 4 price zone but the supporter line at the 4 zones, pushes the price back many times to the 5 price zone. The price couldn't pass the 705 to go to the 6 price zone. If more people will buy, we expect the price will go to the 6 price mark zone. And if more people keep buying, we expect to break through the 6 price zone reaching the 7 price zone. Otherwise, we will stay between 4 to 5 and 6 price zone. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe for more Saitama videos. Thank you for watching.